gentlemen welcome back to my channel so as you can tell by the title you already know what we're doing today but before we get into that i'm gonna tell you what i already done to my hair because as you can tell this is not how i normally come on here but um yesterday i did a clay wash on my hair i did the aesthetic healing clay mixed with the herbal hair wash from tropical naturals i just wanted to do something i didn't know if it was gonna work or what i just wanted to you know try it out and see what happens my hair came out bum um if you've seen the what is it my reel or my um tiktok or whatever you know you see the curls were popping they came through nicely i'll try to link it above i used shea moisture's wash day no wash and go shampoo lately that has been my fave my go-to it keeps my hair hydrated it doesn't strip my hair love it adds moisture that has been my go-to and the deep conditioner that i used i used two, i mixed two for that too yesterday was just kind of a concoction day um i used the one minute miracle max that i use on my channel i'll link it above so you guys can go check that out and i used the shea moisture intensive hydration mask love that love that and both of them had my hair feeling soft and hydrated and moisturized all that good stuff and i was like you know what it is now nine o'clock at night i was like you know what we're not gonna do this at nine ten o'clock at night so we're gonna go to bed so i just put my leave-in conditioner in and put it in these two nights but then when i woke up i needed to detangle so i had to detangle and this is where we're at right now so this is what my hair is looking like yeah um but what we're going to do today is we're going to try flat twists and if you know me or i've been watching my channel for a while you know i cannot part my hair for anything in the world but you know i always try i always try and that's what we're going to do today so i'm going to do some flat twists because i haven't done flat twists in a hot minute so I want to try them and see where it takes me. Okay, so first things first, if you can hear a like a low sound, it's a baby AC because for some reason my room is hot. Everywhere else is cool, but my room is 1,000 degrees, and I'm not having it. So. I got a baby AC if you can hear it I'm sorry but I don't want to be sweating um as you know lately my favorite has been the my yellow granny's white peony because it's lightweight and it's moisturizing so this is what I'm going to be using today and to make sure my hair gets some definition Jesse's coily custard lately i have been using this a lot for my twist outs and stuff and they have been very defined and i have been loving it so that's what i'm going to use today and i'm going to spray just a little bit of water you know so i can manipulate my hair because it is really dry right now and i don't want to try to you know do anything with my hair being super duper dry i feel like this just bad okay so i am going to be doing the middle part because you if you have seen on my channel the last time i tried to do you know a center part like center of my head and have everything coming down that was a fail that was a big fail we're not trying to do that today so center part uh middle part it is okay now it's time for the leave-in and i'm just gonna do a couple sprays in my hand which is not what I did I did a whole bunch of spraying but oh that was it I almost lost it but that's how much I'm gonna use and you know what since it was on the table 
I feel like I want to use the East of Eden Naturals butter from my last video. It was on the table beside me and I was like, it supplied some moisture last time so why not, you know, use it again. So, just going to take a dab of that to go over this whole section. And make sure to get it on the ends. And just a little bit more. Just a little bit. Okay. something that came up in the back of my head like mainly my hair is 4b but at the back of my head I do have some 4c thrown up in there you know so this is not doing what I wanted to do it's not sleeking my hair down how I wanted to so I just reached for a gel that was next to me which is the Cantu gel that I tried out on my channel a while ago so I'm going to use this on the back of my hair so it could you know get you know nice and sleek instead of a big poofy like this one did like this one is really really poofy and I ain't trying to have that I need it sleek and nice you know so I'm gonna use this in the back and then start back using this in the front hopefully I get the result that I want if I don't it's on me but if I do get a good result yes so I finished the back and I just want to say I'm proud of myself for making it this far because normally I don't make it this far because when the other times where I part it in the center and make everything you know go like this I did maybe like a couple in the front seeing it wasn't working I was like you know what I'm done I'm good I really didn't need to do my hair anyway put it up in a puff or something like that. But this time, I'm over halfway down my head and it's looking good if I do say so myself and I do so I'm happy. But first, my sister, she bought me a slush and in this hot room, amazing. And second, um, I think I'm going to continue with the Cantu because I want to add another note I as I've been going around my head I have been cutting off the straggly ends um like you know how the twist method when you twist all your hair up and then cut the um weird ends that you know don't curl right or is thin or like whatever like that that's what I'm doing with these flat twists I know some people probably don't, you know, like that method, but that's all I can do right now because we really, to be honest, we really don't have any natural hairstylists around here. And if, okay, we have hairstylists around here, but we don't have people who specialize in natural hair. Like most, 
most people around here all they do is weaves and braids and stuff like that but I I can I understand that but if I'm gonna go get my natural hair cut I want to get it done by somebody who specializes in natural hair you know and I, I you know they probably know how to cut hair too but I, I guess I'm just picky I don't know I no offense to the the hairstylist around me it's just that i want to go to somebody who deals with natural hair on the daily they know what they're looking for you know My tongue is blue uh it's very blue because of the blue raspberry slush but my hair is done and as you can see i tried my best but when i got to this section over here i got tired of doing the parts so i just started parting with my hands um but yeah this is the finished look and i'm gonna go you know do my edges no, I'm not going to do my edges tonight because it is now 8.45 and I'm not going to do anything. So, I'm going to do my edges when I wake up in the morning. I'm not going to, I don't know if I'm going to take it down tomorrow because I don't know if it's going to be dry and I ain't, mm, but I am going to make a TikTok of me taking it down so you guys can see it. So, follow me on Instagram because I post all my TikToks on Instagram as a reel. Cause you know some people ain't on TikTok, but yeah, let's see. I don't know how it's gonna turn out because this is the first time I'm doing it. Y'all know normally my mama do it, but I think I did a pretty okay job. I mean, it's my first time, so yeah. But what, why is that one sticking out? Um, but yeah. That's it for this video. I'm just gonna try to, you know, make this one better because it was sticking out. Um, before you go, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and click that little bell button so you never miss the next time I upload. And I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye. Wrong eye. There we go.